holiday season is over, but you're still probably enjoying those new presents. But area fire departments and Cuyahoga County Waste Management, they want you to be careful. And for good reason. Many gifts given this past year more than likely include lithium batteries. Now those batteries can be found in electronics, toys, headphones, handheld power tools, kitchen appliances, and of course electric vehicles, just to name a few. Now, we are following through on how to better protect you and your family from fire. Well, News 5's Bryn Caswell joins us live this morning. And Bryn, this is really all about the message of safety. Absolutely. It's so important because these lithium ion batteries can easily overheat and they are highly reactive and flammable. Lithium batteries can cause very intense, fast burning fires that could be difficult for fire departments to put out. You've seen the videos from all over the country. Lithium battery fires are popping up everywhere from the east to west coast and here in Cleveland too. We had about five fires in the city of Parma. I'm following through with the Parma Fire Department after they told me they were seeing an increase in lithium battery fires last March. Firefighter Robert Burez says five lithium battery fires in the city of Parma last year are five too many. They're very dangerous because the fire starts relatively small but it burns incredibly hot. And after about two or three, four minutes of a battery overheating, um, it'll off gas really violently, it'll create a lot of smoke. Ohio Association of Professional Firefighters tells News 5, lithium battery fires are becoming very concerning across the state due to the availability of the batteries, lack of regulation, and the high cost of responder training. Burez wants to warn residents these fires can happen fast and unexpectedly. Any product that contains a lithium battery must be used and stored properly. A lot of it is improper charging. And when we say improper charging, it's maybe hooking them up to a power source that's not correct for the battery that you're charging. Cuyahoga County Waste Management is encouraging proper disposal through various partnership programs. Recycling program coordinator Matt Walter says when batteries start feeling hot or look swollen, it's time to toss them. Don't throw any sort of rechargeable battery, especially lithium batteries in your trash, uh, nor in your recycling. They can and do like frequently cause fires in the trucks, in the landfills, and at the recycling sorting facilities. Walter says batteries can be mailed out through the Call to Recycle program or dropped off at select stores like Staples and Battery Plus locations for a small fee. It doesn't take much for them to start, start those fires, so it is always best to be cautious and handle them appropriately. The Ohio Department of Commerce says Ohio's fire incident reporting system currently does not have a specific category for lithium battery fires, but reports 81 battery related fires across the state since 2020. For more information on how you can recycle your batteries, you can visit this story on news5cleveland.com. Tiffany Mike, it's important to remember if you have an e-bike, an e-scooter, or even a hoverboard, they recommend it's best to charge those either outside or in a garage. Yeah, eye-opening information. It is. Got to be safe, Brent. Thanks.